Oh. Hey. Give me a hand over here, Casey. Sleep there. Whew. I was dreaming I was a big giant YouTube star. I was hanging out with Casey Nashstadt. Man, we were we were up at his place. Or maybe it was my place, I'm not sure. Looked like his place, but I got a feeling it was my place. We were unboxing all kinds of goodies for me. Like uh, stuff for my subscribers and uh, my hawkers. And he was getting jealous. He was like, What what is this crap? You get more stuff than I do now. I'm like, what can I say, Casey? Man. So it got me thinking. It got me thinking. You know, I'm not there yet. I'm a long ways from there. He just got 10 million subscribers I just seen the other day. Let me fix my hat here. Make myself look more presentable. Yeah, he got 10 million subscribers I seen the other day. I like watching some of his videos. I got to thinking, man. You know, why would I be hanging out with Casey, man? I'm like, you know. You know, he's in great shape and all this stuff. You know, I don't have that He-Man body. I mean, is that what it takes to be a YouTube star? You know, I'm not sure. You know, good looks, all this kind of stuff. So, I got to thinking about this. I came up with a graph of, of what my my life or my YouTube, my, my, what would it be like for me to get to that level on YouTube? Like I said, I ain't got that He-Man body. I just don't, you know, don't know what it takes, you know. So I'm going to take a look at, at, at myself, kind of see if I got what it takes to be a YouTuber, a big YouTuber. I'm talking about, I'm not talking, I'm talking about like a big one, you know. First, you know, first thing when you look at me or I look at myself, I'm looking at myself right now, you know, I just see an old dude, you know. I'm like an old dude. I mean, can old dudes, you know, become YouTube stars? I mean, I have looked it up, and there have been some old people that's, you know, become big YouTubers, you know. Some of them dead now. So, I was like, well, you know, I guess there's that possibility that an old fart could, uh, could be a big YouTuber. I'm not sure. So, yeah, then I got thinking, well, you know, even though I'm old, I still think pretty young, you know. I, I still think like a kid most of the time. You, you look at my videos, you know, I mean, you know, I do some pretty foolish kid 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 type things you know so so what would that do i mean would that score me some brownie points would that would that would that make me go up on my graft well first off let's look at my graph and first off i read that only about three percent of youtubers will ever make it big so let's start off there at three percent on my graft it goes up to a hundred so here i am at three percent on my graft as you can see, because I'm an old fart, it's just, we're gonna just keep it about the same. But because I think young sometimes, and I do kind of stupid young things, like farting in videos, I don't know if that's, I don't know if that's young or not, but I don't know, people like it, seems like. So anyway, we're gonna go up a little bit on my graph. As you can see, my graph has risen now to about 10%. Now we're gonna look at the, the way I look, you know. Am I a good-looking guy or whatever, you know? Because, you know, I, you know, it seems to me most YouTube people are, you know, more good-looking people. You know, I mean, not necessarily good-looking, but the ones that are big, the ones that have gotten, you know, big, are, are a lot of them are pretty good-looking people, you know? And and I'm far from handsome, you know? I'm not butt-ugly, I guess. I mean, maybe for the over-50 crowd, I'm okay. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm gonna say, okay, I, I would say that kind of scores me a few more points. So yeah, I'm gonna say that scores me a few more points, you know, with the over 50 crowd. So let's take a look at the graph now. As you can, as you can see, it's risen a little bit more slightly. So let's go on to the next, the next deal. Okay, the next thing is like, uh, do I have any talent? I mean, you gotta be kind of talented uh, to some degree. To become a YouTube or a big big YouTuber, I mean, you gotta have something, you know. So let's just take a look at myself, you know. Can I sing? Well, let's let's take a look at that. Green Acres is the place to be. Farm Liberty is the life for me. 
land spreading out so far and wide. Keep my hand, just give me that countryside. Da, 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 da. So yeah, as you can see, I can sing. It ain't great singing, but I can put it out there. Oh, so, so the next thing, you know, can I dance? Well, let's take a look at that and see. Can I dance? Hmm. <laughs> see I can bust a move a little bit you know the next thing is what other kind of talents have I got well, let's see what things the other thing is what kind of other talents that well I can't fart on command pretty much uh. You know, with those three things, I, I think it kind of scores me a little more on this on my graph. You know, so get a little more points there. So let's take a look at it now. And see what we got. As you can see, it is risen a little more. We're up around the 25 percentile area. But just knowing that, I'm I'm now at a 25 percent chance that I may be a big YouTube star. Okay, well, let's go and look at the next the next of deal okay the next the next thing on, on my list I got to thinking about was what kind of video ideas what you know do I have like good ideas for videos or they are they my own do I do I kind of make them my own uh, and you know I have I have some people telling me that I mean I, I like to think that I kind of have my own way of making videos and, and kind of my own style and stuff so and usually that's usually that's a good deal, you know, because usually if you're you know if you're if you're stuck inside that box with everybody else, there's just so much competition in that same thing. So you got to get break away from that box to to maybe make it. I think with me, I, I am trying to break away from that box, that mold or whatever you want to call it. I have my kind of my own style or whatever. I believe that's another good thing. Let's take a look at that graph again. As you can see, it has risen again. It has risen uh, to about another 10% just from that. The good ideas, you know, my busting, dancing, my singing, my farting. Uh, I'm not all that great looking, but maybe for the over 50 crowd. Those are all good deals, okay? So, let's take a look at the next deal. Okay, the next thing is, what about my subscribers? The, subscriber, the subscribers that I got, how do they feel about me? You know, how do they seem to be responding to me? So far, I mean, the, I have quite a few subscribers that seem to really be enjoying what I'm doing. If I do post a video lately, it seems like I do get pretty quick about 50 or 60 views on it, which generally means that's about 10% of my subscribers are actually watching my content. So, I don't know if that's a great deal, but to me it's great. It seems like I have a lot of people that really enjoy what I'm doing so uh, and I enjoy making it for them and and so even if I just got one if even if I just got one subscriber that's really enjoying what I'm doing to me that's a, that's worth it you know it's it's a good deal just for that alone I think let's take a look at the scale again but I think it's gonna go up again yep as you can tell the scale has went up a little more just from that. Now we've got the subscribers that are enjoying what I'm doing and so it's risen some more. And the last thing I got to thinking about is, and that is do I have the heart in it? Do I have the heart to keep doing this? Do I, do I uh, seem like I want to just keep putting it out there and, and, I, and I do. I mean just that alone there if you, if you get an effort you get and you have the people and you have the heart to keep putting it out there and you keep coming up with ideas I think that's a good thing too. So I think that's going to raise me a little more on my graph. Well, let's take a look again. So as you can see on the graph, I have risen to just a little over 50% on my graph of a 0 to 100. So that means, according to my calculations, I have a better, a little better than 50% chance of making it as a big YouTuber. I don't know what a big YouTuber is. 
to me, becoming a big YouTuber just means that uh, I am making some money. I'm enjoying what I'm doing. And I have people that are following me and they enjoy what I'm doing. To me, that's making it as a, as a fairly big YouTuber. To me, I don't know. But I, as, if I had to put a, a level on it, I would say you have to have at least 100,000 subscribers probably to, to really be doing fairly good at it. Until I get 100,000 subscribers, I'm probably not going to be all that great at it. But we're going to shoot for that. That's what I'm going to be aiming for in the future is 100,000 subscribers. And, you know, I've got a little ways to go. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not quite there yet. But uh, if y'all keep liking what I'm doing, you know, if y'all have any ideas that uh, can help me out, like if you think that's wrong on my graft, uh, if you think I suck, let me know, man, because, I mean, don't be telling me no crappy lies. I don't want nobody telling me, hey, you're great, you're wonderful, and all this junk, and I really ain't, you know. Let me know. Do you really like what I'm doing? It's like this one. This makes, video makes totally suck, and everybody may hate it. You know, I don't know. You just got to keep putting it out there. That's what I try to tell other people. You know, just put out content. You know, just keep putting it out there, and uh, you never know what's well, going to be big. Uh, you may have videos that suck. Try not to have videos that suck if you possibly can, but it's going to happen. Not every video is going to be a number one video. <laughs> I'm going to quit talking on this thing. If y'all like this video, hit the like button. If you don't like it, hit the, hit the thumb down button. Let me know. Give me a comment. Whatever you like, don't like, or whatever. If you think my graph's screwy and sucky or whatever, think I look like crap, uh, whatever, Anyway, leave a comment, uh, hit that subscribe button. If you haven't subscribed, become a hawker, become part of my family. Oh, and be sure to hit that bell notification, that thing, it goes dang, dang, dang. Anyway, you'll become a hawker. You'll be all notified, all my good stuff coming out. I will let you go now. Y'all take care. Bye. Oh, good God, did that suck. That was the hardest stupid thing to make. Jeez. Trying to keep up with my stupid notes here. <laughs> I'm like, this was a hard video to make. Oh well. For some reason, some videos just come right off. I mean, I can just do them like that. This one has been a pain in the butt. Anyway, I'm done. Bye again.